What's up, everybody? Hello, I'm here, and welcome to Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines, as I said in the vlog uh, that should have came out a little bit before this video. Um, I wanted to revisit some of the series as we did on the channel previously, so this is the first one I want to do. I want to try out a different bloodline. So let's jump into the darkness of Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. Now, some of y'all may not know this, but uh, later this year, Bloodlines 2 is finally being released. I am excited. Uh, could directly the character sheet. Uh, I don't want a Bruja. This is who I want to try. Gangrel. Let's see, history. Uh, sexual environmental act. Pagan. What does Pagan give me? Uh, your belief centers on monster. Yeah, and your kinship with nature is strong. After you were embraced, you were naturally more in tune with the beast within, and that affinity is now apparent. Swap the prior order of your attributes to mental, physical, and social. Ooh! And for those of y'all who do not know, um, the reason this really intrigues me, this one, is because I am a pagan. Let's see. <laughs> There's a pothead. Plus the beast, perv, Scott. Yep, we're gonna go with pagan. Like the guys here, love the stance. Uh, we of course are gonna play the male, but here's what the female looks like. Uh, Gangrels are wild loners that are the most in tune with the beast within, allowing them to shape shift into more beastly forms, nomadic in nature. Gangrels care little for vampire politics and prefer to dwell and hunt on the outskirts of society. Because of their animalistic nature, they receive a plus five to strength, stamina, and wits during frenzy. However, because of their inherent feral nature, Gangrels receive a negative one on all frenzy checks. Let's go. We are not going to be named unnamed, so let's. Sorry, the keyboard I'm using is not the best one. Okay. What do you think? Uh, perception wits. Fortitude, that's good. Uh, brawl, dodge, firearms, melee, computer. Not much on intelligence, but uh, I'll accept that. Been a long time since I played a game like this. Well, y'all actually saw the last time. It's the last time I played this game. Let's get into it. Toby Tab subtitles. Show me this. Probably behind my head right there. <gasps> now we'll try to get through the tutorial. <laughs> that looked cool. I'm really interested to see uh, if there's a difference in where we live at uh, in certain areas. Like in the main area. Uh, last time we were adventure, we had a very nice apartment. Brutal. <laughs> Good evening, my fellow kindred. My apologies for disrupting any business or interfering with prior engagements you may have had this yeah, evening. Yeah, yeah, Napoleon. It's unfortunate that the affair that gathers us together tonight is a troubling one. We are here because the laws that bind our society, the laws that are the fabric of our existence, have been broken. No, As prince, I am within my rights to grant or deny the kindred of this city the privilege of siring. Many of you have come to me seeking permission and I have endorsed some of these requests. However, 
The accused that sits before you tonight was not refused permission. Indeed, my permission was never sought at all. They were caught shortly after the embrace of this child. It pains me to announce the sentence, as up to tonight I considered the accused a loyal and upstanding member of our organization. But as some of you may know, the penalty for this transgression is death. Know that I am no more adjudicator than I am a servant to the law that governs hey. us all. Let tonight's proceedings serve as a reminder to our community that we must adhere to the code that binds our society, lest we endanger all of our blood. Forgive me. <laughs> Let the penalty Such commence. Such a politician. Such a politician. He should run for office this year. Yo. The prince for president. Which leads to the fate of the ill-begotten progeny. Without a sire, most child are doomed to walk the earth never knowing their place, their responsibility, and most importantly, the laws they must obey. Therefore, I have decided that this is bullshit! Uh, that is ugly. Quit showing that. All I'm saying is that he better not do it. If Mr. Rodriguez would let me finish. I have decided to let this kindred live. They shall be instructed in the ways of our kind and be granted the same rights. Let no one say I am unsympathetic to the plights and causes of this community. I thank you all for attending these proceedings, and I hope their significance is not Those proceedings lost. are always fun. Good evening. <laughs> but the prince really should run it for politics. Uh, you know, I'd vote for him for uh, presidency. Couldn't do any worse than uh, what the last, uh, well, what any of them in my lifetime's done. It's a little Your strict. sire, tragic, my apologies. But you see, there is a strict code of conduct that all of us must, must adhere to if we wish to survive. When someone, anyone breaks these laws, they undermine the well-worn fabric of our centuries-old society. Understand my predicament. Allowing you to live makes me directly responsible for your subsequent behavior. So, what I'm offering is not generosity, but the opportunity to transcend the fate woven by your sire. This is your trial. You will be brought to Santa Monica. There, you will meet an agent by the name of Mercurio. He will provide the details of your labor. I've shown you great clemency. Prove it was more than a wasted gesture, fledgling. Don't come <laughs> back until you do. Good evening. See, that attitude is what our government and country need right now. Discipline. Following, you know, the code. Things that have all been lost. Sadly, lost. <laughs> What a scene, man! Ooh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> this Love this guy. Out here like a naked baby in the woods. <laughs> How about that? Ah, look, you know, it's probably a lot for you to take in, so uh, why don't you let me show you the ropes? What do you say? Heck yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm Jack. What's important is I'm offering help. You make it back from Santa Monica with your hide, and we'll trade life stories, okay? Till then, I got about this much time. You in or out? I'm in. I'm in. Okay, let's see. Uh, okay, I can use the help. All right. Uh, why don't we uh, step out back here? Like where I am, at least I'm out of that theater. Christ, it's stuffy in there, huh? This is much better. Now, we ain't got much time, but I figure somebody should fill you in on the bare bones stuff at least, you know. Could save your hide. You look wobbly. You even had a drink yet? Nope. Oh, man, we're popping a cherry here. Ha, ha, ha. Oh, you're going to love this. All right, <laughs> check it out. Blood, it's your new rack of lamp, your new champagne. Watch your new fucking heroin, kid. <laughs> Get ready, though, because, hey, it's never as sweet as the first time. 
Oh yeah. What do I do? Well, down around the corner there, I saw this human. Poor SOB can't find his car. <laughs> I wonder if he stole the car. All right. You go down there, casual like. You creep up on him, then bear those little fangs and feed. Don't worry if you weren't captain of the wrestling team or something. Because it'll come so naturally, you think you've done it a thousand times already. It's been one of those nights I could use a drink. Now go for it. Be I sure that's they'll drink. This is important, so listen up. Be sure not to train them dry, okay? It might be hard to resist, but don't kill them. Alright. Blah, 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 blah. feel about this but it does feel good I'd rather say that than be the smart Alec all right now you got the blood you're feeling all kick-ass feeling better than your best day living but wait it gets better all kindred kindred that's a our word for vampire all kindred have a few things in common things that set them right square above humans on the food chain yeah like what like sharper senses a body that can take a beating and if you play your cards right, eternal life. That's no sure bet, but still, a chance at immortality is not a bad deal. And that's just for starters. French benefits for joining the club. So I'm going to live forever. Well, you can still be destroyed, but forget the books and the movies. Garlic, it's worthless. A cross, pff, shove it right up their ass. <laughs> <laughs> the steak, only if it catches you in the heart, and then it just paralyzes. Running water? Eh, that's no problem. I bathe. Occasionally. <laughs> now, a shotgun blast to the head. Oh, that's trouble, boy. Fire? That's real trouble. Sunlight? Well, you catch a sunrise and it's all over, kiddo. Get it? Got it. Okay, now. <laughs> the fuck is this? You get inside here and head upstairs. Get up there. You do that. Alright, we are not going to make it through this whole tutorial today. That is okay, though. Now, some controls are just basic. A lock pick around here somewhere. I may not be that perceptive. And my last character uh, was perceptive enough to see it. Oh, there he is. Okay. Here. Stay away from the windows. Oh, it's a Sabat raid. Sabat? They're, uh... Oh Christ, I was hoping to spare this shit till later. Uh, the Sabat, well... Uh, they're mostly mindless, bloodthirsty assholes. That's all you need to know for now, all right? So what's up? The Sabat got wind of the gathering here, so they figured they'd raise a little hell and put a little heat on the new... What's the prince a prince of? No time for political rundown. Job one, get out of here alive. 
Spot might be mindless, but they hit like a Mack truck, like raging savages. Nothing a fledgling like you wants to mess with. What am I supposed to do? Shh, shh. Heads up. Hey. Back away. Try to handle myself. Cool. Now, if you want a lesson on how really not to act, take notes from those sabbat assholes. You're a big bad vampire. Yeah, great. Congrats. Now keep it to yourself. You go roar and you beat your chest, and that's what you can expect. Wait. I've still got that list of people from high school. Why not? It's the same reason you don't let humans see you feeding. It's why the wolf doesn't want the sheep to know he's there. It's also why you don't go juggling dumpsters or outrun the 815 from Sacramento. And it's and it's why you didn't know any of this when you woke up this morning. Valid point. Keep our secret secret and you make things easier on all of us. We're living in the age of cell phone cameras. Fuck-ups ain't tolerated. Makes sense enough, right? Well, it ain't a casual thing for a fledgling like you. What do you mean? What could happen? That party back there with the guy in the suit and the Magilla Gorilla? The assholes that put your sire to death? That's the Camarilla. They make a tidy business out of enforcing vampire laws like this one. Vampire laws. Ah, uh, I see. All right, now don't worry, because I know the area a little. You know what? I'm glad we're in this situation, you and I. It illustrates a point. You gotta utilize your surroundings. Okay, but well, what does that mean exactly? You do what you gotta do. Theft, destruction of property, breaking and entering. <laughs> These would be the least of your sins before the night's out. I'm so down look around with that. here. You gotta get out the back there through that magnetically sealed door. There must be a key someplace. I'll find it. Yeah, yeah, I know. I know. I have to get through this. This is our point. Is, uh... Save. It. There we go. All right, we are going to save the game right here. Um, because really, I'm out of time. Um, if you have enjoyed what you saw here, go ahead and hit that like button down below. If you are new to the channel and want to see more, subscribe. Hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. But other than that, if I can learn to talk. Uh, but as always, guys, I do want to thank y'all for watching. And I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.